You want to show what's possible of creating an online business by actually showing the benefits. Hey everybody, Joel here, and today I'm going to teach you how to do proper affiliate marketing using social media, okay? So the first thing I want you to understand is all social media platforms you rent. What does that mean? Well, you rent that space to market your products or services, and then based on that, if they don't like something you're doing, you can be shut down very, very easily. And I'm also going to show you how you can run Facebook ads that are compliant with Facebook and then how to market to those people your network marketing opportunity. As an example, you can't do network marketing. You can't do a lot of different ads on Facebook. I'm going to show you a little bit of a hack of that today. So here's how you do proper marketing. OK, so let's let's just name some of the key social platforms. So let's call this Facebook. Let's call this one. Instagram, let's call this one Tick Tock, okay? And there's many others, but you wanna do the same thing over and over and over again. What most people do is they take these platforms and they drive traffic to a website and depending whatever type of traffic that they do drive, it's not very good because people will post again and again and again really, really stupid stuff like they'll post uh, want to make 30 grand a month, direct message me, stuff like that. That kind of stuff doesn't work. So you want to show what's possible of creating an online business by actually showing the benefits. So clearly on here are my benefits without like showing them off, right? So if you look here on my page again, uh, here's a picture of me uh, on the beach working on my laptop. Here's a picture of my Ferrari. There's a picture of me in Egypt. These are the benefits, not the features, the benefits of running a home-based business, right? And so this part is done on purpose. The other things I want you to uh, pay attention to is I never ever post anything that's like, hey, join my team here. No. I post relevant stuff. So right now the Amber Heard and the Johnny Depp thing is going on big time. Uh, so I post a little bit about that. The key is to get likes and eyeballs, okay? Um, so as an example, just being brutally honest with you, I posted this one a few hours ago. It's not doing so well, but I kind of thought or hoped it might. Uh, but the key is never get emotionally attached to one idea. So you'll never, you'll see across all the things that I post. Here's another one that did okay, 195. You want to get likes and you want to get shares. Here's the key to your success right here is when you share, when people share a lot of your stuff, that goes way more viral. And when it goes more viral, you get more followers. Okay. Now you look at that here and it's the same thing. This is my fan page, which you got to create a fan page. Okay. You have to have a fan page. Uh, and then on my personal profile, I do things that are very similar. So big time in the news right now, something that's relevant, Elon Musk bought Twitter. So I created a little bit of humor. You should either be educating, triggering, entertaining people. You've got to create an emotional response with your posts because those are the ones that go the most viral. So this is relevant in the news right now. As such, you got 214. Now you also want to comment back to people too because it creates engagement. Uh, one of my businesses, I'm in the fitness business. so. I posted this picture here, but I didn't say join my fitness team right now. No, I posted my own progress, 334 likes, 100, uh, you know, 100 some comments, not a whole lot of shares here. You're going to get a lot more shares when you create a fan page, okay? Based on the uh, algorithms of Facebook and so forth, you're going to get a lot more shares if you create a fan page. Uh, so go and create your fan page as soon as possible. Here's another one, again, 63 shares. That's what brings more and more people to get what? To get these followers, 201,000 followers there, okay? Now, coming back to my screen here, what you need to do is take all your traffic to a opt-in page, opt-in, where this opt-in page needs to have a form for a name and a box for email. This is where your money is made okay because you're going from renting space up here you're renting social media space 
okay? Two, when you build data, when you collect names and emails, you own this. Once you collect the data here, that's your data forever. So let me go and create a, uh, a new slide here. So this is what I wanted just to show you again. When we come here and we have this opt-in page, you got your name, you got your email box, and you got a little submit box. Once you own that data with people putting in a name and an email here, now you can market whatever you want to those people. And that's why that's where the money is made because you can do all types of ads differently. So as an example, uh, one ad to promote my fitness business I have right here on the page. And this was designed just to simply collect leads. So I ran this ad. When people sign up for free, it generates a name and email address. Uh, you know, 585 com 376 comments, so on and so forth. So all of my social media. So what I wrote to you on the screen, I'm going to show and prove to you in person. Okay. What I say is what I actually do. So if we come here, look where it goes. All my social media goes to joelterian.com. So uh, Joel or Joel F. Terrian, because I track off both. So this is more fitness centric. If I click here, it redirects to here. And guess what? This is the same thing as this page here, collecting a name and email address and a little bit more data is what I'm talking about right here. This is your clear call to action opt-in page. Once you have that data, you own that data for life. That's what's really cool, okay? So there's one of my social media platforms. The other one, my personal platform, again, look where it goes to, Joel Terrian. This one's a little bit different. This one's to join my free coaching program. But again, name and email address across the platform. If I come to my Instagram, same thing. Look, all in my bio here, over to joelterrian.com to collect a name and email address. Same thing with my TikTok over here. Um, now you can't put a direct link in, but at least I still have it there. In other words, you can't click on it. You can probably click on it on a, on a, on a device, a mobile device. But the thing I want you to see is I'm no huge social media influencer. You know, only 300 views, 400 views, 200 views, 224 views, 469 views. Again, none of these videos that I've posted are about, hey, join my team right now. That is the worst form of flattery that you can do and it just doesn't work. So coming back over to YouTube, YouTube something that I've been spending a lot more time on. I only have just under 9,000 subscribers. I don't get in a huge amount of views, 469, 182, you know, some YouTube, and I will get there, some YouTubers are getting hundreds of thousands of views every single video. But what I want you to see here is I actually, again, every single video that I do links back to where? My opt-in page right here. All your traffic needs to go to an opt-in page from your social media profile. So even though I'm not a huge social media influencer by any way, shape or form, I'm going to show you even as small as the following that I have, the engagement that I have, which is still good. Don't get me wrong. But again, I don't have 400 million followers like the rock does. I'm going to go into our CRM here and I'm going to show you all the new revenue that was generated. This is just new clients and new revenue for the month of April. Okay, so April 1st, to April 27th is the day I'm shooting this. This is all new signups, eight pages. So roughly 300 new customers, which generated $4,217. Now, if we wanna look at the upsells of those customers, I click here and I go here. Here's another $17,000 in brand new business. This isn't recurring business, this is brand new business. Now, what I wanna show you that's really interesting, see these daily backups, just $9.97? That's called an order bump. So if I come over to list elevate here, okay, list elevate is something that we're doing a lot of with right now, which is having other people build your email list for you. But here's what's really cool. If I click here for the dollar trial, you'll see it right here. I have automated daily backups for $9.97 per year. Okay. So that's a dollar trial. Now, of course, if they don't want to take that, they go here, but most people want to protect their content and income, right? So that's what these little 
bumps are. And these little bumps for 997 probably generate about $60,000 a year in pure profit. So there's one CRM system. Another CRM system we have as well at, over at GBO. So again, for the month of April, uh, over eight pages in signups. So three or 400 signups there, a lot of dollar trials. Now these dollar trials, all these dollar trials, okay? If I come here and I go to bill or upgrade, so let's go to bills. So these are where the upgrades come from. $8,173 in upgrades. So these are people that came in for a dollar and bought something else. Somebody bought a website here, somebody bought a website here. If I go to upgrade, this is another form of order bump that we have, another $9,000. So if we look at the $17,000 and the $18,000 here, just in new business, we're talking close to $40,000 a month in new business. And what's that all because of? It's because of being able to email market to those people because they come to where they come to an opt-in page here first once i get their name and email address i can market to those people and when i market to those people this is where the money's made by staying in touch and sending these people email that is absolutely the most proper and best way and the only way to do your online marketing show first all the benefits of running a home-based business. Not the features, not like click this button, make $30,000. Make people feel happy, make people feel engaged, make people feel entertained, whatever the case may be. You drive those people to an opt-in page, then you email market to those people like I've done here, and those are the types of revenues that you can see you can generate. So you go from renting that social media to your opt-in page where you get a name and email address. Once you have that name and email address, that's your data that nobody can ever take away from you. And guess what? You can market that data to as many people as you want. So as an example, just coming back one more time, this was a Facebook compliant ad. It had nothing about a home-based business. It had nothing about network marketing. It was an ad about get in the top shape of your life and get 36 years of my knowledge absolutely free. This is absolutely compliant, but once they signed up and I got their name and email address, I can soft sell them other things of that I do, like running a home-based business, like we're losing weight a little bit faster, whatever the case may be, because that's my data. So listen guys, if you like these videos, hit the like button, hit the bell notification button, please leave me a comment so that it helps out with the algorithm and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.